Hello, I'm Philip Stoughton. I'm here at Apex 2018 and I'm joined by Almar from Nordsena Simtech. Almar, thanks for stopping by to chat. Some new products uh, that you've got here for the first time that you actually initially launched at Productronica, at the Helios. Tell me a bit about that. Yeah, so <clears throat> last November in, uh, in Germany we showed the Helios platform to the world and uh, so this Apex show was showing it uh, for the first time in the US. It's a platform that's targeted at uh, medium to bulk volume applications for us. So uh, we're talking about sealing, gasketing, potting applications uh, and also thermal paste. It's applications that we were doing in the past on our micro dispensing systems but those were not really catered towards those applications. So now we finally have a, a new platform which is really uh, well, pointed at those applications and for those markets and their requirements. Yeah. Okay, and in terms of what that gives you in performance improvement over previous systems, how much how much quicker, how much more volume, how much more throughput? Well, the, the, the big difference with our old platforms is the, uh, the volume that is being dispensed. With the old platform, we're talking about micro drops uh, in, in the microelectronics. Here we're talking about multiple CCs, uh, for instance, for a potting application and also the two component uh, dispensing where in the past we, we didn't really have the space inside our platform to do two component dispensing with long static mixers. Now this new platform has got a very tall vertical clearance so we can put in uh, large mixers and with that we, we just open up a whole new market for us. Yeah. And the response in Germany was good. What's the response been like here by comparison and how do the markets differ in their demands? It's, uh, well, the response up to now has been very good here. Um, I don't know if the demands are that, that much different. Uh, you, you do see some different industries here. Uh, I know in, uh, in Europe it was mostly automotive industry uh, that we had um, the interest from. Over here it's, it's a little bit more mixed, uh, but it's, uh, yeah, it's very well received here. We've got some good leads. Yeah. And what else is going on in the dispensing market and with a Simtech at the moment? What are the what are the demands from the customers that are keeping your engineers developing new solutions? Mm -hmm. Well, for for me, I'm uh, the product manager of the more industrial applications. It's uh, it's, it's not just throughput, but it's a lot of it is uh, on the control of the fluid, uh, feedback uh, of the systems, and, and just assuring that the amount of fluid you put down is correct. Uh, if if it's two component, assuring that the, the mix ratio is correct. And it's uh, more just this real process control of the of the fluid, and that's uh, we do have that a lot in the micro uh, dispensing, uh, where we've got a lot of experience. And now with uh, with this new Helios platform, we borrow uh, a lot of the experience from a sister company, North and Sealand, and we combine it to also get this process control into the uh, the, the more bulk applications. Yeah. And that process control comes back to traceability to to data that everybody's looking to get around the line. Is that something that customers are demanding? So when they look at the traceability of a product, they want to know how much has been dispensed and where it's been dispensed and be able to look back over, over a period of time of the performance of that. Yeah, yeah so the data logging uh, per part or per carrier or really that after two years, you can go back into your database and you can see what batch of material was used, uh, what the status of the equipment was at that point. Uh, that's, that's more general, uh, that's, everybody's looking for that, so more sensors and more, uh, just more registration of data of what's going on. So not, not directly the process itself, but just to make it traceable uh, in the end of what, what has happened in the past. That's, I think that's a general trend, of course, that we see the last few years. Uh, yeah, I think people are demanding that level of control but it's also the domain expertise in, in getting the product right in the first place and dispensing the right amount as well as recording it. Almar, thanks very much for your time and thank you for stopping by. Thank you.